sir in the last videos we covered about data hiding and abstraction what is data hiding outside person should not access our data directly by declaring private variable by declaring variable as a private we can implement data hiding what is abstraction okay hiding internal implementation just to highlight the set of services what we are offering is the concept of what abstraction now the next whoop concept what we have to talk is yes take very very special care encapsulation this word is very important for the exam sake even for interview room also right en encapsulation are getting encapsulation can you please tell capsule capsule sir what is the meaning of capsule ah can you can you please tell capsule sir have you ever used the word capsule ha ah, if you if you are feeling cold cold then immediately we are going to use cold act capsule cold act cold act capsule sir how the cold act capsule looks like do you know something like <laughs> capsule medical medicine capsule looks like uh, okay color of all medicine by default will be there inside uh, sir this is this is the cold act cold act capsule one capsule right do you know whatever medicine required to cure cold act that that medicine is going to be encapsulated are getting is going to be grouped is going to be grouped into this capsule are getting capsule is nothing but one one group one unit unit okay sir so all the required things grouped into one capsule is 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 nothing but this is the medicine, medicine capsule right same way sir what is capsule yet programming what is encapsule encapsulation yet programming very simple sir assume that suppose student is there student student is there for every student some data members are there and uh, some behavior methods are there something like student name roll number marks or data members next uh, uh, get the marks update marks read write these things are nothing but student behavior okay like the process of encapsulating grouping data members and the corresponding methods uh, into a single unit sir best example here i am taking for every student uh, name will be required name is required for every student uh, age next uh, roll number roll number marks uh, required roll number marks are required name age roll number marks are required plus plus for every student uh, corresponding methods uh, okay read method is there okay write method is there like uh, the corresponding methods this uh, total data and the methods i want to group uh, into a single unit uh, that unit itself is uh, nothing but class uh, student are you getting student class contain student related data student related behavior the process of grouping grouping combining data members and the corresponding methods of behavior into a single unit which is nothing but encapsulation are you able to understand right capsule grouping mechanism itself is like this right sir every java class every java class is an example of encapsulation so from our childhood onwards in the books if you open any book uh, then it's going to tell pass what is the meaning of encapsulation that's all this itself is nothing but encapsulation the process of grouping data members and the corresponding methods into a single unit is the concept of encapsulation every java class is an example for encapsulation any doubt are you able to understand theoretically right now the same concept a bit more practical orientation just observe so some some in in reality in reality what is encapsulation very simple sir if any component if any component follows follows data hiding and the, and the abstraction sir last two whoop features whatever we covered one is data hiding i covered second one is what Uh, abstraction we covered 
if any component follows data hiding and abstraction that component is said to be encapsulated component are you getting if any component follows data hiding and abstraction that component is said to be encapsulated component sir now observe that i can use the word encapsulation encapsulation is equal to data hiding encapsulation is equal to data hiding plus abstraction data hiding plus abstraction is itself is encapsulation right data hiding plus abstraction itself is what encapsulation so if any component follows data hiding and abstraction which is nothing but encapsulation theoretical okay sir can you please explain a small chota program to demonstrate this encapsulation right now let me take a small example i am taking class account sir observe very carefully class account account for every account for every account private double balance balance field is there private double balance balance field is there sir now this balance variable cannot be accessed directly by outside person because the reason is private remember this one because the reason is private outside person can't access this data directly that's why it is the private okay data hiding next the, how the outside person can able to access compulsory we have to provide getter and the setter methods for this variable okay now i'm taking get balance public public double get a balance public double get a balance get balance balance now validate 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 sir perform required validations because so whether this person is the correct person or not ask is username and password and so on yes valid if this person is valid return balance if this person is the valid return balance balance like this right now sir i want to update my balance i want to deposit i want to update my balance something like public public void public void okay sir i want to perform withdraw operation i want to perform withdraw withdraw operation assume that sir or sir i want to change my balance set a balance set balance double balance double balance like this right okay boss can you please withdraw so on so amount or can you please deposit so on so amount like so here also you can perform the required validations okay if it is a deposit if it is a deposit sir this dot balance is equal to balance this dot balance is equal to sir this dot balance balance is equal to is equal to sir balance this dot balance plus amount whatever amount we are going to provide sir assume that amount so current balance current balance plus amount plus amount like this we are going to take that's all a simple example a simple example i have balance variable is there this balance variable declared the private outside person should not access our data directly next how the outside person can able to access sir by using getter method and setter method the advantage of providing access through getter and setter methods is is uh, sir we can perform the required validations are you getting outside person is always going to call either get balance or set balance so through that after validation then only he can able to get the required data or he can able to perform required operations right so now i can use the word it is the best example for encapsulation are you getting example for encapsulation now i have bigger doubt is there if you are telling it is the encapsulated component compulsory it should follow data hiding and the abstraction compulsory it should follow data hiding and the abstraction sir where is the data hiding yes yes where is the data hiding declare this variable as a private data hiding okay well perfect but where is abstraction 
Yes, friends. Where is abstraction? How you can conclude? Yes, sir, this is abstract. Uh, uh, abstraction is there in this example. Hmm. Remember, remember that. Okay. So I never going to highlight this get balance or set balance functionality to outside person directly. What I will do? I will sir provide sir one GUI screen to the end user. GUI screen, maybe JSP based or or otherwise some AWT Sphinx based somewhere, somewhere. Okay, some GUI screen. In the balance inquiry, there is one button is there, sir. Balance inquiry button. There is another button is there. Okay, deposit something like. Whenever end user, whenever end user, end user click balance inquiry. Now get the balance method will be executed. Whenever end user click balance inquiry, then get balance method will be executed. Whenever end user click deposit deposit, then set the balance method will be executed. Are you getting? Whenever end user click deposit, set balance method will be executed. But end user don't know. Internally, which code is executing, which methods are executing, end user can able to say only these two buttons. Internally, is it Java code, Dart code, Python code? Also, you don't know anything. You don't know anything about that. Just he uh, should. He is going to click that all. The required functionality in the background is going to execute. We never going to highlight our internal implementation to the end user. Are you able to get right? That's why I can use the word. It is the uh, sir what we call abstraction. So data hiding and abstraction, which is uh, nothing but encapsulation. Everyone can able to understand. Sir, two definitions I provided right. Sir, what is the definition one? What is the definition one? Grouping data members and the corresponding methods into a single unit is the concept of encapsulation theoretical thing. If any component follows data hiding and abstraction, that component is said to be encapsulated component. Sir, best example: de declare data member as a private and for every data member. Provide getter method and the setter method. Okay, like uh, and we can provide access through some GUI screens itself is uh, nothing but okay encapsulation, right? Sir, have you observed here one small thing you people should be aware, sir. Is it possible to access this uh, data member directly? Can you please confirm? Is it possible to access uh, this uh, data member directly? No outside person can't access right. So if outside person want to access, he has to call get balance or set balance method. So uh, through get balance and set balance only, we are going to provide our data. That's why get the balance and set balance. Uh, so it is interface for outside person. Internally our balance data is going to come. That's why hiding the data behind the methods. Can you please observe my statement very carefully, sir? Hiding data behind the methods is the concept of encapsulation. Remember this one, sir. Hiding data behind the methods is the concept of encapsulation. Okay, like now here there are two important conclusions are there. What is the advantage of encapsulation? What advantages are there? Okay, whatever advantages are there for data hiding and abstraction. All those advantages are advantages for encapsulation because encapsulation is not a new word. It is the data hiding and abstraction only. That's why first, first one security we can able to achieve or we can able to get security. Second one enhancement will become very easy without the affecting outside person. Without the affecting outside person. We can able to perform any type of changes internally. Enhancement, okay. Third one, sir. Third one, the biggest thing what we are going to get maintainability of the application, modularity of the application will be improved. Are you getting maintainability will be improved, modularity of the application will be improved, sir. 
these are the advantages for encapsulation but anyway among all these things the main important advantage whenever we are using data hiding or abstraction or encapsulation the biggest advantage what we are going to get security the first group of oops concept is security main target is the word security right data hiding or abstraction or encapsulation security is the important word okay well now there is one more small point is there if you are getting something compulsory universal rule we have to miss something are you getting if you want to get something you should miss something sir what we are going to get because of encapsulation ha huh? what we are getting because of encapsulation security we are getting but what we are going to miss because of encapsulation yes we have to compromise we have to compromise we have to sacrifice something then only we are going to get sir the security what is that is so for every data member compulsory we require to provide getter method setter method every time validations must be required validations must be required then only i can able to perform required operation it increases length of the code validation everywhere validation 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 it increases length of the code slows down execution are you getting so i want to get balance so best example if you want to know your account balance you are the valid customer you are valid customer of the bank but still you can't get directly your account balance you have to provide your username password then only you are going to get so validation must be required or not yes if you want something you should miss something here you are going to get security but uh, it is going to time consuming process performance is going to be down remember that so that's why so everywhere don't try to implement security don't try to use encapsulation if for security constraint is there then only we require to use encapsulation sir best example i want to perform fund transfer to my friend account 10000 rupees assume that sir 10000 rupees funds transfer i want to perform in the icic bank to perform funds transfer of 10000 rupees how many activities you have to do you have to provide your username password next and after that otp you are going to get next uh, in your card back side grid uh, you have to enter some numbers you require to enter some number after doing all these things after 3 minutes or 4 minutes you can able to perform you can able to complete transaction of 10000 rupees for your friend are you getting so the problem time consuming performance is down but advantage right person only can able to perform funds transfer security by default you are going to get clear any doubt about this one so three words you should aware what is encapsulation what is the advantages of encapsulation what is the disadvantage of encapsulation these are things you people should be aware very clearly right sir can you please observe the process of grouping data members and the corresponding methods into a single unit is nothing but encapsulation next uh, what we call if any component follows data hiding and abstraction is the concept of encapsulation hiding the data behind the methods is the concept of encapsulation advantages security enhancement will become easy maintainability modularity will be improved the bigger problems with this is sir performance is going to be down because it is the time consuming length of the code is always going to increase because validation logic is has to execute that's all sir clear for all of you right very important this encapsulation word for the exam sake even for interview room also a bit theoretical but compulsory you should aware